Today, let's check out this Circa 1909 Flying Merkel. Well, welcome to Bader International's Classic Online Motorcycle Sales. What I have here today is a, actually this is a Merkel and not a Flying Merkel. This is the single cylinder belt drive. And the reason we call this the Merkel is because it really wasn't officially called a Flying Merkel until about 1912. The first ones were produced in Middleton, Ohio, or Middletown, however you'd like to say it. And then right around 1912, uh, they moved over to Pottstown, Pennsylvania, and started producing the motorcycles there. This is a very, very original, very complete bike. And I actually had this bike probably about 12 to 15 years ago. And since then, it's been in a prominent collection. And we just got it back, happy to say. What makes this so nice is when you see the early bikes with chrome plating on them instead of the nickel, which it should be, means that this bike was probably restored back in the, oh, 1960s, 70s, maybe even up into the 80s, but I doubt it. And back then, people just weren't reproducing parts for these bikes, which gives me a very solid feeling and very confident to say that all of this motorcycle is dead on original. Of course, when you say dead on original, items like the rubber products, obviously these are bicycle pedals, and that's not correct, but it's not a reproduction. Looks like it has the original leather belt, has the glass bowl hiker carburetor, or hiker. It's all the proper surge pumps and everything. And even the tool kit or the glove box even says the Merkel. Or actually, in this case, it says the Flying Merkel. So that might have been added on a little later on, probably right around 1910 or 11. And what's so cool about these bikes is the, as you can see, the gas tanks are made out of copper and brass, so they don't rust. So when you go to do a full restoration on these bikes, the original gas tanks, as long as they're not all beat up, are usually in very, very good condition. Has the carbide generator. Solar. As well as the gas powered headlight. Looks like the brand name has been polished off years ago. And it's in very good condition, has a very nice latch on it has the reflector in the back, along with the, um, all of the jets and so on to make it work. Again, a very, very nice, solid unit. And it looks like the magneto has been worked on. Uh, from what I understand, it doesn't show sparks, so it's going to have to be rebuilt. Looks like there's a little bit of a repair on the frame here. Pretty typical. And it looks like they had also a little bit of repair on the rear motor mount tab here so again for what it is it's in excellent condition looks like the clutch is all there very nice everything's working like it should but to find a, a very nice original bike like this when I say original obviously restored many many years ago but 
most likely 100% all flying Merkel. It's very hard to come by these days. And I prefer to find them in this condition here than one that's fully restored because this bike sort of tells the tale to where bikes that are restored. If you don't know who restored them, where they came from, and so on, it's a guessing game. Well, you can check this bike out on our website, baderinternational.com. You can give me a call if you'd like. I'd be happy to talk to you about it. Also, when you're on our website, check out all the rest of the bikes. We usually have about oh, around 50 bikes at all times available for sale. Also, if you like what we do, make sure you hit the thumbs up. And also, please subscribe to our page. And if you'd like to leave some comments, I do get around to answering them as quickly as possible. Thanks for watching. If you have any questions, please give me a call.